back to our YouTube channel, don't forget to subscribe and press the bell icon. Before creating hacking tools, you must know these things. In networking, learn protocols like TCP, IP, UDP, HTTP, etc. In operating systems, get familiar with Linux, especially Kali Linux. In cybersecurity principles, understand vulnerabilities, exploits, and secure coding practices. Next, you will choose what is the most popular language for building hacking tools is Python due to its simplicity and vast library support. Like you can go with C language, C language is for low-level tasks like writing malware. JavaScript is for web-based exploits. Ruby used in frameworks like Metasploit. Install Kali Linux. This penetration testing OS includes pre-installed tools and libraries. Python environment, ensure Python 3 and PIP are installed. Code editor. Use tools like Visual Studio Code, PyCharm, or Nano. Many Python libraries simplify tool creation. Scapy for network packet manipulation. Requests for HTTP requests. Socket for creating network connections. Paramico for SSH automation. Beautiful Soup for web scraping. Now that your environment is set up and the essential libraries are ready, it's time to put your knowledge into action. Python is an easy to learn, yet very diverse and powerful programming language, and that for the language of choice for many hackers. Learn to write your own tools and use them on Kali Linux to see how hackers attack systems and exploit vulnerabilities. Developing your own tools will give you a much deeper understanding of how and why attacks work. After a short introduction to programming with Python, you will learn to write a wide variety of hacking tools using many practical examples you will quickly find out for yourself how terrifyingly simple that is. By integrating existing tools such as Metasploit and Nmap, scripts become even more efficient and choose the knowledge you have gained here to test your systems for security holes and close them before others can take advantage of them. Every hacker needs their tools and ethical hackers are no different. Our digital toolbox starts with Kali Linux, a free and open source operating system designed specifically for penetration testing and ethical hacking. Think of it as your hacking Swiss army knife. Kali Linux comes preloaded with a vast array of tools for network scanning, vulnerability analysis, and exploitation. But before we dive into these tools, let's talk about the basics of ethical hacking. Ethical hacking is all about finding and fixing security vulnerabilities before the bad guys do. Choosing the right programming language is crucial. Python is a popular choice due to its simplicity and powerful libraries. Setting up your environment is the next step. You'll need a virtual machine to safely test your hacks without risking your main system. For now, just know that Kali Linux will be our base of operations, our digital playground for learning and practicing ethical hacking. Imagine you're a detective arriving at a crime scene. The air is thick with tension, and every detail could be a crucial piece of the puzzle. The first thing you do is survey the area, gather information, and identify potential clues. You meticulously document everything, from the smallest piece of evidence to the overall layout of the scene. In ethical hacking, network scanning is our reconnaissance mission. Just like a detective, we need to understand the environment we're dealing with before we can proceed. Using a tool like Nmap, Network Mapper, we can scan a network to discover active devices, open ports, and running services. This is akin to identifying all the potential suspects and witnesses at a crime scene. This information helps us create a map of the network and identify potential entry points for further investigation. It's like drawing a detailed map of the crime scene, highlighting areas of interest. Think of Nmap as our digital detective's magnifying glass allowing us to peer into the network and gather valuable information about its structure and potential vulnerabilities. With this tool, we can uncover hidden details that might otherwise go unnoticed, just as a detective uses a magnifying glass to find clues invisible to the naked eye. Every piece of data we collect is like a note in the detective's notepad, each one contributing to the bigger picture. By carefully analyzing this information, we can start to see patterns and connections that lead us closer to solving the mystery. Network scanning is just the beginning. It's the foundation upon which we build our entire investigation. With the right tools and techniques, we can uncover the secrets hidden within the network, 
just as a detective uncovers the truth behind a crime. Section 5. Diving Deeper with Wireshark Now that we've mapped the network, it's time to put on our detective hats and analyze the data flowing through it. This is where Wireshark comes in, a powerful network protocol analyzer that captures and displays network traffic in real time. With Wireshark, we can examine individual data packets, see what information is being transmitted, and identify any suspicious activity. It's like listening in on a conversation between devices on the network, giving us insights into how they communicate and potential vulnerabilities in their protocols. Section 6. Metasploit – A Hacker's Playground Metasploit is the ultimate ethical hacking playground. It's a framework that provides a vast collection of exploits, payloads, and tools for penetration testing. Think of it as a library of pre-built hacking modules ready to be deployed. With Metasploit, we can simulate real-world attacks, exploit vulnerabilities, and gain access to systems in a controlled environment. It allows us to test the effectiveness of our defenses and identify weaknesses that need to be addressed. Section 7. Burp Suite – Unmasking Web Vulnerabilities The internet is a vast and complex web of applications, and web applications are often prime targets for hackers. Burp Suite is a powerful tool that helps us uncover vulnerabilities in web applications by intercepting, modifying, and replaying web traffic. Using Burp Suite, we can test for common web vulnerabilities like SQL injection, cross-site scripting, and cross-site request forgery. By understanding how these vulnerabilities work, we can develop strategies to prevent them and secure our web applications. Section 8. The Ethical Hacker's Oath With great power comes great responsibility. As ethical hackers, we have a responsibility to use our knowledge and skills for good. We must always obtain explicit permission before conducting any security testing, and we must never use our skills to harm or exploit others. Ethical hacking is about making the digital world a safer place, not about causing chaos or personal gain. By adhering to a strict ethical code, we can ensure that our actions are always in the best interest of security and privacy. Section 9. Conclusion. Your journey begins. Congratulations. You've just taken your first steps into the exciting world of ethical hacking. This journey is not just about learning how to hack, but understanding the principles and ethics that guide this field. It's about using your skills to protect and defend, rather than to harm. We've explored the basics of ethical hacking, delving into the foundational concepts that every aspiring ethical hacker needs to know. From understanding the hacker mindset, to learning how to think like an attacker, you've gained valuable insights that will serve you well in your future endeavors. We've learned about essential tools like Nmap, Wireshark, Metasploit, and Burp Suite each of which plays a crucial role in the toolkit of an ethical hacker. These tools help you to scan, analyze, and exploit vulnerabilities in a controlled and ethical manner. And most importantly, we've emphasized the importance of ethical considerations. Remember, with great power comes great responsibility. Your actions as an ethical hacker must always be guided by a strong moral compass. Remember, this is just the beginning. The skills and knowledge you've acquired are the foundation upon which you will build your career. The field of ethical hacking is ever-evolving, and there is always more to learn. The world of ethical hacking is vast and constantly evolving. New threats emerge every day, and with them, new opportunities to learn and grow. Stay curious, stay vigilant, and stay committed to your continuous improvement. There's always something new to learn, new tools to explore, and new techniques to master. Whether it's a new programming language, a new security protocol, or a new hacking tool, the learning never stops, and new challenges to overcome. So, keep learning, keep practicing, and keep pushing the boundaries of your knowledge and skills. The more you practice, the more proficient you will become. And always remember to use your powers for good. The true mark of an ethical hacker is not just their technical skill, but their commitment to making the digital world a safer place for everyone. Your journey has just begun, and the possibilities are endless.